with you. I have got the wonderful Mule Bone here in the studio with me. That that's gonna are keep we live? going to keep going. We are live. Right What's on. up, Jeff? How you do? Welcome back. Thanks, man. You got to come back more often than like once every seven years. Well, we figured that's how pros do it. Put out a record every 10 years. <laughs> well, no, the, what I was going to say was, it, uh, you know, in the, in the early days of our existence, you were one of our all-time favorite guests. And there, there were people who, you know, knew of us then and listened then. And, you know, I mean, the, uh, you know, that long medley thing, that, the Jesus on the main line yeah, medley yeah, that you guys yeah, did. Yeah, yeah. I, we'll still throw that on every now and then. And we'll, we'll. People will go, what was that? Oh, you, did you, you mean you guys live? taped it? Oh, yeah. Stu- oh, cool. Right on, right on. And um, I guess I knew that. We knew that. Yeah, yeah. And then I know we never recorded it. Did, well, yeah, you guys well, did. Not, but, well, not in the epic yeah. version. We have, our first record has, a, has an abridged version. <laughs> yeah. And today, thankfully, we have many more listeners than we cool. did then. So Hi, new uh, listeners. Yeah. So uh, it's kind of interesting that, you know, we keep saying that, oh, man, Mule Bone's coming back. Mule Bone's coming back. And people are... So what? what? Huh? <laughs> um, you know, but it's not like you guys have been slacking. You guys are you guys are real busy. Yeah. Um, you've uh, real your studio Excello yeah. in in Brooklyn has yeah. really taken off. Yeah, it's working. I, it's working. I, I know a lot of people who've worked with you over there. Yep. Yeah, it's it's it, we have done a lot a lot a lot of records. And then uh, John, you're still out with Beth Nielsen Chapman and yeah, quite a bit actually. This and, summer I'll be doing a bit with her and Deepak. And like once in a while with him, and uh, and I've got a really cool new thing in New York called uh, Kaleidophonic, which is kind of an African jazz fusion thing. But Hugh and I have been digging in deeper, and and the new record and stuff. This is really what we've renewed our vows, Jeff. Yes, well, no, see that every ten years, and this is the <laughs> that's... we're talking. We're t- we've made T-shirts, man. A lot's <laughs> changed, bro. Well, see, you know that's that's Alan's the going thing. To press tomorrow, Jeff. Like pe- people have again, people have asked about you guys. And I'm like, yeah, well, you know, they, they've each got 35 different things going on. So it's like, you know, Mule Bone, they get to do once every five years or something like that. Yeah. But it's true. You guys have, like, consciously or unconsciously going to, like, take this run much more seriously than, yeah, than most of us are expecting you to. Yeah, we, we're, actually, we're, actually, we're actually scheduled out through, dare I say, October in Europe. We're going, we're, we're, we're got, we got a whole little we got a Midwest in thing, Canada, and then we're taking a break. And then we're going to Europe in, in the beginning of October. We both figured out it's cheaper to pay two guys than four. <laughs> it took a while. And listen to this. After 10 years, we have an official dot .com uh, Mulebone website. We have a website? website. Mulebone.com. Yeah. Last time when we were here, the people that we didn't, the record came out. It was handwritten. It was on brown paper. <laughs> and the only thing on it was like our phone numbers. Like That's people right. were going to call us on the telephone. There was no website, no nothing. This year we've saw, in fact, our record release party tonight at the, uh, at the Saint. We don't actually have a CD, but for your listeners, we brought a visual aid. Yeah. A we, we have we the mock-up mock-up of the cover. Of the CD. <laughs> <laughs> and it tells we've got a Facebook page, man. We got a That's MySpace. Right. Go to we got a website. Music.com. Yep. Tonight is going to be outrageous. I've I already said it when uh, when Fordham was here, Reverend Freak Child. It's going to be an amazing night. You guys, String Bean and the Stalkers, yeah. who I guess you probably know as well. Sure, Kenny. Yeah. yeah. And uh, and and Freak Child. Uh, it's 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 re- I I am really really looking forward to me this too. night. It's fun. I mean, when Scott from the Saint told me that he hey guess what I booked Mule Bone, I was like no way because uh, I know because I've been talking with your radio promo guy Joe Estrada. I'm, I'm eventually going to get Joe. yeah. I'm eventually going to get a Mule Bone record. So, yeah, cool. This is good. And now it's here. And this is going to be great. Cool. Um, we're, so, we're, th- we're thrilled, man. It's been, we, we enjoyed the previous two times we came here, and this was both of us put it on the radar. We're like, oh, man, we'll go down there. And in it. May, it's going to be awesome. <laughs> cool. Well, let's, uh, let's, let's play something live. Spark it up. Let's play. Let's yeah. do it. Let's play something live, because that's, that's what we've been telling people is, is going to be the, uh, the thing. <laughs> Hey. <laughs> we good? That's good, yes. Bye. 
It's a small world, but precious little do we see. And it's a big job, yeah, to be who you want to be. Yeah, most get off of the chance with your success and romance. But it puts a boy into a trance and it don't last long. Until another man done gone is our guest here this afternoon. They're going to be over at the Saint tonight. First time in, uh, I don't know, Scott will remember, five, six, seven years. Yeah, yeah. something like that. Um, with uh, Reverend Freakchild, who was here earlier this afternoon, and String Bean and the Stalkers, longtime favorites here on the Jersey Shore. Mulebone, new album, New Morning. They are here to play us a whole bunch of songs because that's what they do. Yes. Um, even when they're not Mulebone. They're out somewhere playing songs. We are. Trying to put food on the table. That's what they Feed do. Feed the chilling. Yeah. Mulebone, for lack of a better description, has been a part-time thing while you were doing all the other stuff that yeah. made much it's more money. A steady part-time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, steady, a steady side project. You know, well, I'm, I'm sure Deepak pays better than, than Mulebone. I'm sure working in the studio pays better than Mulebone, but well, there's... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, all right, okay, yeah, it does, so go ahead. <laughs> From, for those of us who really enjoy listening to Mulebone, we, yeah. we really appreciate the fact that you guys are, uh, are not always about the dollar, no. And and sometimes about the music and the fun that, and, and and fun. and yeah, I mean music. hopefully you know, hopefully the new album takes Mulebone to new heights and and you kind of have to make this a semi-full-time thing. 
Yeah, well, we're, you know, we're just doing what we got to do. You know what I'm saying? Well, I guess yeah. between now and October, it, it is a semi-full-time thing. Yeah, we're making it up as we go along, Jeff. What are you going to do? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> You're not newcomers anymore, so, uh, no. yeah. You no, can't. we're just trying to get paid before we die. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't we all? <laughs> um, I think it's. I think it might be time for another. Another right, one. Let's switch to another another let's one? do okay. a title track, and then all we'll right. do some trad stuff. How do you play it again? Am I in the right tuning, John? Yeah, you are. Just wrong notes. Right tuning. <laughs> Oh, I got it now. It's been a while. Here we go. No morning, no morning, no morning. 
I was a liberal arts major in college. I had never lived in another country. I didn't speak a second language. What could I? What could I? What could I offer the Peace Corps? The answer surprised me. I served in South Africa teaching HIV AIDS awareness, and together my community and I brought electricity to our village. Developing a computer training center in Armenia was one of the most challenging and most rewarding things I've ever done. Working with my students in Nicaragua was a great experience. We taught each other a lot about our countries and cultures. This is the Peace Corps today. Different people, different skills, one common goal. To better our world, one community at a time. Now that I'm back home, I run a community service program. And I'm in graduate school studying environmental science. Redefine your world. Join the Peace Corps. Apply now at peacecorps.gov. is our guest here in, uh, on this Wednesday evening. They are going to be over at the Saint tonight, which is uh, kind of a record release party because we know the record's coming. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, I mean, it's better than you being here and we not having a record. Absolutely. Um, so now... a lot of things, Jeff. He's <laughs> done a lot of damn things I can think of. So, uh, so you got the name back, too. Well, well, we never we just, lost. We just plowed you, you don't. You don't have to be Mulebone UK anymore. Do you know we took it, man. I think the other people are just not active and whatever. We backed off of it for a minute because an attorney advised us, advised us to back off of it. But then the other, you know, it we started be, this it thing should in be 19, stated. It was, we, we started the, this thing in 1996, right? I didn't even own a computer in 1996. I didn't know anything about the internet, and we put out a tape, just a cassette tape in a yellow package called Mulebone, and it actually contained about half the songs that were on the original Mulebone mm -hmm. CD. And then in 1999 or whatever, we went back. We said, "Well, the tape, the we right, whatever it was, we the tape, the tape sucks because half the songs suck." So <laughs> we just John called me up and he was like, "Let's listen, eliminate these songs, record new songs, and put out a CD." And I was like, "It makes perfect sense. Let's do it." So we did it, and we put the record out, and we didn't do anything, and it was still just all laughs. And then uh, you know, MP3.com had just started at that time. Yeah. And uh, and we kept, and I and we found out through touring that there was another band called Mulebone because they had somebody else's picture in the newspaper, and uh, we we started looking and going to MP3.com and seeing their 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 hits, you know, going up and up and up and up and up in, a, in sort of an exponential fashion right at the time that we were yeah that promoting the record yeah. to radio, and so that was the deal. And then we got offered this deal with uh, with the with the label out in one of the Ryko labels, um, and but it was out in California. And, and we were doing it, and uh, the idea of changing the name sort of coincided with us playing quite a lot at the bottom line with Alan Pepper, and that was that. But so we didn't do, we did that, you know, changed it to Mulebone UK, but we didn't put out a release. And then when we went, we said, let's do, man, we got to do this. Let's get this. We had tunes. We we're ready to do it. And we started searching, and that, the other Mulebone band has been defunct. And it's not defunct, but it's been, they haven't, they, have, they haven't done shows yeah. in eight years. Oh, God, and they, yeah. there's some little fledgling band in the, in the Upper West coast that you know in seattle seattle but the, but it should be stated because we haven't yet said this but but truly there was not a band called mule Bone before no, of we course started. it wasn't no 1996. And this, the other band picked it up a couple years later and then this other band picked it up another five years later after that and i was so sort of we, condescending we really do kind of feel like that's okay for us to call ourselves mule Bone since we were the first ones to yeah. call ourselves mule yeah. Bone. yeah and i think and I'm, I'm sure you've had this conversation but i think all you have to do is in some sort of concrete legal way, prove that you were using the name before the others that. existed. Yeah, well, we have just probably if we found their placards and bills and stuff from the yeah. brotherhood. If anybody does, yeah, I got a cassette with the yeah, copyright got, on it. Yeah, man. I got the cassette. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. I, th yeah, I think you're cool. Yeah. <laughs> but we, so we, the URL we didn't we the URL we took was MuleboneMusic.com because we we didn't want to take MuleBone.tv. <laughs> <laughs> It may seem intimidating, but really, it's one of the easiest things you can ever do. I've been
Free Park, Reverend Free Nina, Bone. I'm there no way to long. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what. Uh, um, the one of the. Oh, hey, we. Do you thinking that will do six? It was a. There's a lot from we. Is it just. Maybe there. I'm saying there were. Just did. Recorded use. Together is together. And this record is five, six. Yeah. This album, I don't know, with the first. Yeah. yeah. Really, the the result. Incredible. Gary Day. So, you know, because it's done. But real quieter. Acoustic. It sounds. It's actually. But a couple of original is they were they're fine. Hey, let's do it. And then playing and the first time and then have when you're uh, what's right. juicy and the <laughs> cleanse. Um but then it ended up with version of years. You know, and then, so then it was back only the sort he said it's a little but should now it's turning off sound we record he said you know and no problem Stuck in the mud, but I'm gonna hit my mark this time. I can't waste my time talking about a second chance. When all around inside my head, the devil's doing his dance. It ain't a disease, it's a slide by degrees. Gonna find me on a cement slab in the 21st century, but I'm gonna hit my mark this time. I'm a little tiny nation, one of God's creations. I'm just a shadow in the dark, yep. I'm gonna hit my mark this I'm just a shadow in the dark, yep. I'm gonna hit my mark this time. God gave me money, God gave me time. But to meet my destination, I've been waiting in line to find a good use for my little cup of life. I took a little walk by the river and got stuck in the mud. But I'm gonna hit my mark this time.
Excellent. Yeah. From Mulebone here on 90.5 tonight. Uh, really looking forward to tonight over at the Saint in Asbury Park. Us too. Uh, Mulebone along with Reverend Freak Child and String Bean and the Stalkers. Thank you so much, Hugh and John, hey, man. for, Thank for you. coming Jeff, by Thank again. You. Thanks for having us. My pleasure. My pleasure. You guys are always welcome.